what is going on guys um it's currently february 5th right now 2024 I haven't posted a video in a couple months i'm sorry about that i've been posting shorts here recently i mean but there's like nothing been posting because nothing has been done actually all oh, has been done ecu fully done um i'm here to watch the video i'm pretty sure the East, it wasn't even the car wasn't starting the car has been starting for months now got the ecu worked out been tuning in everything um it's i just not ordered a stage one fly me yacht clutch which if y'all know the fly me yacht clutches they're right about 318 foot pounds of torque and you know this is this ain't making 318 foot pounds of torque stock you know so turbo kit is getting ordered tonight for this bad miata right soon to be bad, soon to be bad but um name a couple mods i did to the car but so far i'm i did a couple months like a month ago like the same thing i'm doing right now but i didn't post it because i didn't think it was that good because i was kind of shy for some reason but i want to get new wheels for the car but i kind of like the wheels on I don't like them, but I might get new ones. I don't know yet, but let's look inside the car so y'all can see the new mods. All right, so first mod. All right, a pillar. Boom, got this. Got my FR gauge. It's broken right now because it came loose again. And don't mind these wires. This is to this is a hundred percent safe. Safe, safety's first. Y'all know me. Safety's is always first. And we come over here. And here's a radio, Sony, um, ZV1 A4000 something. Pretty cool radio, $500 I got for Christmas. So, yeah, it's a nice radio, sounds good. Got new speakers, but y'all can't see the speakers. They're Will Blues, something, something like that. <sighs> but here's the, uh, yeah, radio, pretty cool, everything. And that's, like I said, I need to reconnect them. But I'm gonna hopefully put here, um, hopefully here on a couple of days from now, the clutch will get here. And I'll, I'll try to post a video on that, but I'm probably gonna do it by myself because my dad, he wants me to help, like, do most of the stuff on myself. And, like, so, I, I guess, but he probably helped me here and there. And I'm gonna get, and Turbo will be here on my birthday, which will be in 20 days from now. So, um, yeah, I can't wait for that. And I I can't promise y'all I'll make a video on that. Because um it's all work and it's probably better views than me on there, but I'll just show you the aftermath, I guess. I I probably put your views here here and there. Not all of it though. But um yeah, I turn sixteen here soon. So I'll be driving Turbo Miata. Pretty cool, you know what I'm saying? But it'll be so it's a Kraken turbo kit. It's going to be the 2550, 2554R Garrett turbo. Uh, it was it was that or the 2560 and the 25, um, 2550R. The 2554, I heard sometimes it's a little bit better than 2060. So um, that's why I picked as it and everything. But y'all will see that when, I, when it comes here and everything. I'll, I'll make a... Oh, that, that chick on my face. Gosh anyways don't mind the chicken um oh i gotta show y'all the tune tuning and everything so let me get back to you with the tuner what's up camera anyways I'm just turn your computer on and this is a great thing about having a click away signal is you can take your signal off well um I have a laptop in the car and it's not turning on it was charged last night it was on 32% last night. I'll be right back. Um, I guess the Chromebook died. Anyways, y'all y'all seen two videos. I, I registered it yesterday. 70 bucks down the drain. So I had like auto-tune, I guess. Um, I, don't, I don't know if it really did anything. My car really don't start in the morning because um let me not start it, it i mean starts but it's like has a hard time starting because it has aggressive ti aggressive timing on it but um since there's not really anything cool happening in this video let me show you something cool anyways so my, my i'm not gonna tell you all my goals this year 
It's getting, it's getting hot in this car. But uh, I'm post this. I'm post this. I'm going to get edited. I'm going to do editing. I'm going to get this all done here soon. And my dad's got home. So if I got a parking spot when I come back. Because I like to be over here. But um, I'll, I I promise you I'll post more. Because I'll be driving here soon. And I can post more and stuff like that. Going to car meets, I guess. I don't know. But anyways, see you on the next video. Hopefully I get done this week. Um, it's a bit of a temp. Should be around a temp because that's when the clutch should the clutch should be here sooner than that. I should order it sooner because I ordered something else for the Miata, which I put on the car, which you can start the car without putting the or putting putting the foot down the clutch. But it broke on me. I mean, it's got stuck. So, okay, I am back. If you can tell, it's a little bit darker outside. I went inside to charge a Chromebook, and I was just gonna post a video without like showing you all the tune, but it'd be kind of boring if I just did that right. So might as well show you it. So what you do is, let me switch the camera around. So all you do is, oh, we'll cut the camera off real quick. Okay, so all you do is, so get your ECU that's under your feet. If you have the 99 Miata, you get your bike extender, plug into your laptop. Can't see. There we go. And we're just gonna turn the laptop on. And yeah, okay, we're gonna wait. I get back to y'all when this turns on. Hopefully, there we go. Guys, when we're waiting for this laptop to turn back on, um, tell me about your days in the comment if this video is even blow up. I'm, I'm trying to figure out the, the YouTube algorithm again because it changed again. It always changed every time I, I take a break from YouTube. Like I don't take a, I don't take a break on purpose. I mean, there's nothing to post sometimes. So I'm trying to figure out the um, the YouTube algorithm because it changed on me again. Cause I was getting like a bunch of views. Not a bunch, like a couple thousand views here and there. But now it's kind of harder because um, they change it. Anyways, I... Anyways. Um, pulling the tuner series up, and here we go. Alright, so first, you want to go to the EFI. Don't mind that. Just... Anyways. First you want to do... Is you want to download the, download the website. It's on the EFI, you just search up EFI page, whatever. Download it, you create a server, mine's money pit, cause this is a money pit. Okay, and I bought, I registered it, so yours, your might look different than mine. And everything, oh my gosh, how many mail is there? Oh my gosh, anyways. So yeah, here it looks like it tells you your RPM, your battery, vote, so I'm gonna start the car up. So here is it tells you your RPM. It's accurate. RPM is at fifteen hundred volts. It tells your volts thirteen. Um, what's I say? I don't know what that is. It tells your uh, calibrate. I need to fix this. Remind me tomorrow. It tells me your injection settings. I really don't know. Um, FR. That's, I don't think this is right. Because it usually be like fit fourteen twelve. Anyways, I, because I bought this, I can I mean, it would continue for me. There's my dad. Anyways, start all the tune. So it tunes for you, I guess. I don't know what it really, what it does. And then I got two step right here. Launch control. This is my setting. It's ten degrees. So it sounds aggressive. I'm not gonna do it co start, but I probably I post another video. It it will spit fires. You saw it be a dark. You can do five foot shifting if you want to. And make sure you put it on seven thousand because I seen it um, it it be at five thousand and will not let your car go over five thousand RPM. So yeah, make sure you do that. And that's really it. That's how you get two step and everything. Um when I mean, also when you get your um, turbo, you have a turbo you all that, you're going to have to go on Google and search this up. Got KPA, like 10 pounds, let's say you want to make 10 pounds of boost. You want to search up 10 pounds of boost, KPA, you know, put in wherever that is. Right there, and you know, turn this on, and over boost and everything, it's so like your maximum boost, over boost. 
So like you do like fuel cut, spark cut. I'm pretty sure you want to do fuel, fuel cut, so it, it just cuts your fuel, so it won't overboost no more. So yeah, that's it. That's all you gotta do right there. And let's go back to the gauge cluster. And that will get so you can see. Anyway, you can put your laptop in the passenger seat and um see how much or see like let's say you want to go for a drive put your laptop in the passenger seat dialogue it and you click stop dialogue and everything and also this is your throttle position center so y'all can see that and okay so maybe y'all can hear this let's see if y'all can hear this I don't know if I can hear that, but that's two step and everything. Or that's the launch control. But my uh, um very, very sticky tires. I'm pretty sure y'all heard before. So they're very sticky, so I don't really need launch control, but when the turbo it's probably gonna make them slip kind of. I'm I'm gonna try to be pushing around 300 horsepower. Hopefully. I I was gonna build an engine over summer, but I have so much um money in this car I, don't, I might wait on that till like i get my bread up or i might just buy a different car no like i still get me on everything and there's a toyota but i might you know get something else i could get another project car or truck even like i really want a diesel really do but that's it for this video guys and if you enjoy this video like and subscribe it's not that very advanced and i'm not showing you how to do this anything because I'm with, I'm the same boat with y'all. I don't know what I'm doing really like on these tuning stuff. I really want to go to school, like college, and um, I, there's some school in Ohio that they came to my, our high school, and I really want to learn how to tune. It. It's like high performance school. You, you do drifting there, everything. They teach how to tune everything. I really want to go, but I don't want to go to college. I don't want to go to college, so I'm probably not gonna do that and just learn from home skill because it's better. I think. I think it's better to learn how to do stuff at home than spend a couple hundreds of thousands of dollars to go to college instead. You know, you know what I'm saying. I think it's better to teach yourself. It makes you feel better about yourself and everything. And also, it's pretty cool. It's down those. Obviously, it would tell your cold car is cold. It's a frozen symbol because it's still warming up. And everything. Yeah, this is this is wrong. I don't know why it's not worked. But in your Mega Sport, you can do a bunch of stuff. Like, I can right here, all this stuff. See how I want to do. So, yeah. If you know what you're doing, this would be easy for y'all. But all I know is blue is rich and red is lean. That's all I know. And lean is bad and rich is good. So, yeah. That's all I know. And it's pretty cool to watch that move. But anyways, where's the exit? Anyways. Okay, well, by the time you've seen this, um, wait, that makes no sense because I was about to say by the time you've seen this, I'll be editing the video, but the video will be already done, so I won't be editing. I'll probably be putting forward on it. But um, I don't know. I'm probably, I'm probably going to compare myself tonight, like this video and the videos in the past. I feel like I'm talking a little bit better now. I'm not stuttering as much, not nervous. Honestly, I feel like I'm not big enough to be talking in public, so I want to be private and I'm gonna try to get used to these um controls. Anyways, have a good day. See ya.